Hello and welcome. So in this video, we're going to cover this simple and genuine method. And here's the thing, okay? Even if you take this method, you can actually use it to save yourself some money. And it's pretty cool. And I, I talk about this and I share it. I've even got this over inside of the university just because this method is ridiculously simple, okay? So if you are in the university, you can go through here. We've got, you know, how this works using Amazon arbitrage tools and lots more. Side note, if you're not in the university, keep an eye out for the video on Friday because we're going to open the doors for 100 people and then it will be closed until later in the year, okay? So you can see in here, this product is retail arbitrage. Now, this works especially well at Christmas and there are a number of ways you can do this but essentially this whole method works by finding a product cheaper online now i'm not going to tell you you need to go onto hundreds and hundreds of websites and be sat spending a long time with this because who's got time for that let's be realistic instead i'm going to share with you just how simple this method is okay so for this i'm going to come over to this website over here now this website here i'll show you this now is called studio now this is a big catalog company in the uk but here's the thing okay if you have you know an online website within your country so for i mean you can even do this method with walmart i know people are doing this over in america with walmart you can do this with amazon ebay you could even do it with etsy to a degree and that, that might sound like a lot of nonsense but let me explain this to you okay so i like to use this website over here for this example because this is where i did it myself many years ago okay so I would come on here, this studio, and I would scroll through. Now, normally when I'm doing this method, I'm looking for things normally about £50, so about $50 or above, okay? And I'd scroll through like this, okay? And I'm just looking for something within that price range because anything less is not really worth our time, okay? So we're scrolling through. <laughs> Hopefully something will come up here. Yeah, okay. So here's one. This one here is £60. Have we got any more? let's just go with this one okay so when i see a product above 50 pounds i want to know if we can make money with this okay and i'm not going to be laying out my own money by any, i'm not going to be doing that so how this method works is i find a product like this once i have done this i go over here and i right click on the picture okay and then i scroll down oh let me move my head wait oh what's going on here let me get rid of that so i find i'm going to move me over here I find the picture, I right click on here, and then I click on search image with Google. Then what happens is it opens up this little tab over here. And then I can drag the area which I want Google to search from. So I'm going to put this here, and then I'm going to click on search. And then what's going to happen is Google is going to go out across all of the different websites and find websites which have got this exact image or product listed on the website. Now I can see over here, it's listed at 60 pounds. If I then scroll down, I can see here, Sports Direct, the exact same product. We can see High Pro, High Pro over here. They're selling it for double, double the price. So you can see the potential with this. Scroll further on the page here. This one, there, this is Studio, and we've got someone listing it over on Facebook Marketplace. And all we're doing here is we're just finding products, but we can see here, 60 pounds, 120 pounds, okay? So that's a product which we could use with this method. And as you can see here, you can actually use this method to save money. Just right click on an image when you're on Google and search for it, You, it's called Google Lens. Search for it using Google Lens, you can save yourself some money. More importantly, you can make some money, okay? So we've got a 60 pound difference here, okay? Pretty cool. So that's just one product, okay? And look, not every product you're going to select will work with this. It's just going to be a case of finding a couple, okay? So let me see if we can find another one which is above £60. So that's a great one. Really good. Let's keep coming down here a little bit more. I wonder if I can just filter this via low to high. And that will save us a bit of time with this best match. There we go. Price high to low. Let's do this. Four grand! No, <laughs> we've gone a bit too high here. Let's... Come a bit further on the page here. Let's come down. Lazy Spa, Clever Spa, Far Fong. Oh, I don't know. Let's come a bit further. Look at this here. Scooter, £500. Let's try this. Right click, search image with Google. And yeah, search. Move my head. I'm going to click on search. I'm going to see what comes up. So this one over here is £500. Let's scroll down here. 
so that one wouldn't work because it's actually cheaper on other websites so again like i said it doesn't work with every product that you find it's just a case of scrolling through and finding a few so i'm going to come a bit further on the page here okay let's just go on to let's go on to page two i've got a lot of pages on here but again like i said this, this is just the criteria that i have for this method crazy car no come on i thought we'd be getting in near the hundreds a bit quicker than this let me scroll down one last time no 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 i'll tell you what i'm gonna do i'm gonna do this i'm gonna go over to let's go over to this one i'm gonna scroll through okay i'm just gonna find one other one because it honestly this method works it really does what f is that let's do this right click search image with google 160 pounds over here let's click on search yeah yeah and i can see like this one here is 160 pounds i'm gonna scroll down here as well let's have a look 160 160 how much is it on ebay let's have a look on ebay really quickly 299 that's dollars okay but look this this is the concept okay so we go ahead and we scroll through and we're searching for different products okay whereby we can we know that if we was to go ahead and sell this product we would earn some money so in the, in the example that we started with the difference in what we could buy it for and what selling for online would be 60 pounds okay so it's at this point here whereby you have a decision of where you're going to basically share that product okay so you could do this on places like um, Facebook Marketplace. I know people do this very well. You could even go ahead and get that item listed on platforms like eBay. Or you could, I mean, you could if you really wanted to go down a website route, but I probably wouldn't recommend that to be honest with you. So I would probably go over onto eBay and list that product on eBay. And how this method works and why you don't have to allow any of your own money is you would list that product on eBay for sale. Once somebody buys that product from you, they obviously send you the money via PayPal. Once you've got the money in PayPal, you come over to the website where you can get the product, you buy the product, and instead of having it shipped to you, you have it shipped to your buyer on that platform, okay? And there's a number of things that where people, you know, get confused with this is because they think, well, I can buy it for 60, I'm selling it for 120, I'm making 60 pound profit. You're not, you've got to take into account different fees. So depending on the platform where you're going to sell it, you'd need a calculator. So like this one over here, for example, is called eCal. eCal, eBay, I'm just gonna take that in. And we can see over here, look, it's a free calculator. And this will basically tell you realistically how much you can earn. So it's got auction style, buy now. So if I click on buy it now, scroll down here okay and i'm just going to do this really quickly so no store level no business listing and you can see on here look you get 20 listings per month on ebay so i'm going to click on free listing buy it now so if we know the product let's, let's just go back to the product to make this a bit simpler okay if we know the product let me do this let's go to best match if we know the product was how much was it? i think it was let's find it again scroll down here there we know it's 60 pounds okay we know it's selling online for 120 so to make this you know a bit more interesting or a bit more appealing to someone we would sell it for say 100 pounds because we're making money the buyer is going to be saving money essentially because they're going to be saving 20 pounds by buying from you instead of going to you know a different website then if we scroll down here we've got all the images we've also got all of the yeah you can see on here details and things about this okay so I'm going to come back onto this calculator and I'm going to put the buy it now price at hundred pounds. Okay. Shipping and handling. So that would be the normal um, postage that you would pay. But because you're buying it from over here and over on this website, if you buy a product of 50 pounds, they have free postage. Okay. So that, that would be zero. But again, you'd need to just double check that. We're going to leave it at one. But again, you know, if you wanted to list it as five items and you could do that, but let's just leave it at one. So we're not, you know, inflating the numbers scroll down here and i'm just going to list it in look list in two categories schedule we don't want to schedule it we don't want none of this okay but we are going to upload images so it doesn't cost us to upload images we don't need this 
a super size image, yes. So let's just scroll down here, okay? Now, item costs. So how much does this cost us? Well, it costs us £60. True, shipping and handling, well, it's free. So if I now click on calculate, and I will be able to see, scroll further down the page here, down at the bottom here, profit and loss is £26.40 on that product. So we can see over here, look, eBay and PayPal fees is £13.60. Item cost, total expenses, total selling price. So for that one item, if we listed that item on eBay, we would make a profit of £26.40. That's for one item. And how does it work? Well, you would literally you'd come over here, you would save these images like so, then you'd go on eBay and you would list it for sale. You'd put your title in up here, you would upload these images that you've downloaded, you would then scroll down the page here, and then you'd click on here, and this is your description. Copy that, paste it into eBay, that's it done. And again, look, this is just one way that you could do this. There are many other options with this. And this, by the way, is studio it is specific to the uk but i know this works with walmart and there's lots of different websites and different you know catalogs and wholesale um, stores and things like that, that you can use with this website it is just basic retail arbitrage but especially at christmas you know it's a great time and a simple method that anyone can use to make money so yeah take care and i'll see you soon Bye.